You're highly likely to find nuts on most lists of the best foods to eat for fertility. But which nuts are good for fertility? How do they help? And how often should we eat them? Well, I'll give you my five favorite fertility boosting nuts, answer all these questions and more. Stay tuned. First of all, all nuts are good for fertility, but I will tell you my top five in just a minute. Nuts are a key component of a Mediterranean diet, which has been shown to be one of the best diets for boosting fertility. Furthermore, nuts are rich in good fats, plant proteins, vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants, all of which have been found to be beneficial for fertility. In addition to being a delicious snack, as a plant protein food, nuts can be eaten in lieu of meat a few days each week. This can be good for fertility, as studies suggest that boosting our intake of plant protein can be a beneficial strategy for optimizing our fertility. Now I've checked out the research, and although there hasn't been any studies undertaken which specifically tell us which nuts are best for fertility, by reviewing the nutrients in different types of nuts and analyzing which nutrients are important for fertility, we can rate which nuts are going to be the best to eat. So I won't make you wait any further. I've awarded my five favorite fertility boosting nuts to coming in at fifth place. I've given the honor to macadamias. Creamy macadamias are rich in micronutrients such as thiamine and manganese. But the reason I've put them on the list is that they're incredibly rich in good omega-3 fats. In fact, a whopping 81% of the fat in macadamias is omega-3. Omega-3 is great for reducing inflammation, which is a common cause of infertility. Now I've awarded fourth place to cashews. Not only are they absolutely delicious and are a good source of iron, but most importantly, they have a super low GI rating. Foods with a low glycemic index, or GI as it's often known, help to ensure slower digestion, which helps keep you fuller for longer and maintain a healthy weight. And of course, a healthy weight and well-balanced blood glucose levels are both beneficial for fertility. Anything under a rating of 55 is considered low, and cashews have a rating of 25, which is absolutely excellent. Third place goes to walnuts. Like macadamias, walnuts are also rich in good omega-3 fats, but the reason why I've given these guys higher on my list is that they're incredibly rich in antioxidants. In a 100 gram serve, macadamias have around 150 milligrams of antioxidants, whereas walnuts have over 1,500. Antioxidants are great for fertility as they fight off toxins called free radicals, which can damage our eggs. So the more antioxidants that we get in our diet, the better. I've awarded second place to pine nuts. Now, personally, although I love all nuts, these are one of my favorite nuts in terms of taste and texture. They're fantastic roasted and added to a salad for some extra crunch. Although even after all these years, they do still remind me of my ex-boyfriend from college. He used to love them too, and I'll never forget overcooking them one day and almost setting the kitchen on fire. So if you are grilling them, keep an eye on them as they only need a minute or two. But I digress. The reason I've awarded them second place is that they are super rich in two key nutrients needed for implantation, vitamin E and an amino acid called arginine. Studies suggest a link between these nutrients and increased rates of implantation, as both arginine and vitamin E seem to increase the thickness of your uterine lining, as well as opening blood vessels to increase blood flow. 
So what more excuse do we need to incorporate this delicious nut in our fertility meal plan? Now, it was a close competition, but I'm awarding my top spot to, drum roll please, Brazil nuts. Now, like all other nuts, Brazil nuts are rich in good fats, protein, vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. But the reason that I've awarded this guy, my favorite fertility boosting nut, is that it is so rich in a mineral called selenium. In fact, two Brazil nuts per day will meet 100% of your selenium requirements alone. Now, selenium plays a key role in a healthy reproductive system, and selenium deficiency is a common cause of infertility and miscarriages. Furthermore, selenium is also a powerful antioxidant, fighting off baddies so that your eggs don't suffer any chromosomal damage. But at the end of the day, remember that all nuts are good for fertility. So I'd recommend mixing it up and incorporating different nuts on different days, aiming for around 30 grams of nuts each day. The best way to make sure that you're achieving all of your key fertility foods in your diet is by following a fertility meal plan. And I've created one to help get you started. You can download this for free from melaniemcrice.com fertility. And may I ask please, if you found this video helpful, please share it with your friends. Post it on your Facebook page or send it out via email. Share the love as you never know who else might be trying to start a family and really appreciate these tips. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. So. <laughs> uh.